What's up guys, how's it going? Have you guys had um, bubble tea? Or tapioca ball tea? I don't know. But um, this one, we always go to this place, 99% Tea House here in Fremont. Uh, this one is Nutella with like cream. It's really good. Mm -hmm. Today is day two of um, the kids' spring break. Day two. Uh, earlier today, we went to um, the movies. Well, we kind of rushed. We kind of rushed to the movie theaters this morning. Uh, we watched. Um, Pterodactyls again. Um, we went to go watch. Uh, what's that called? Uh, that gnome. That gnome. Um, Sherlock gnomes. Sherlock gnomes. It's like a cartoon an animation for the kids. It's pretty good, actually. Um, if you're into um, cartoon animation and all the other jazz, it's pretty good. And then I went to um, pick up some shirts at Golden State Active Wear. So we're gonna get that out of the car right now. Alright, so um, let's see what's in here. This is a couple things in here. One is for an order that I got on the website. Um, thank you, uh, thank you, Jeff, for ordering. Thank you for the support. The other one is a lot of samples because, um, like I, I kind of mentioned it before, that we, uh, we, I'm starting a, um, a little bit of a clothing brand for the DJ community, so I'm trying to rev up and trying to get all the pieces together for that. Um, Gildan had a um, new item that they put us like the soft, heavy, soft material. I think it's like six ounces, but it's like green spun. So I got a sample of that. I'm gonna try it out and see how I like it. And we're gonna go from there. And also, I got some stuff overseas, some cut and sew stuff. Uh, as you guys may know, earlier this year I went to the Magic Show. The reason for that was um, trying to get manufacturers to do cut and sew overseas. So we're going back and forth as far as the, as far as the design, and I think we nailed it. Um, we'll figure that out soon. But I gotta get this thing started because it's been overdue as far as the um, the the clothing brand. Um, and I did sell. Uh, I used to have a. Uh, I used to have two um, heat presses here. I sold all that. Now it's more of now I gotta rearrange some things here and get it ready for and, and just basically get it ready for um, the new season. So uh, yeah. Oof. I gotta clean all and I gotta clean all this stuff up. The screens are left out. I hate leaving out screens. My OCD is not helping. Alright, I had to change. Getting cold in the garage. Look at my eyes. Allergies. Ooh. My glasses on. Uh, spring sucks because it's allergy season. <laughs> uh, I have bad allergies. But I wanted to show you guys. Um, Alright, guys. Um, I wanted to go over some of the two items that the um, Gildan has brought out this year. One of their new stuff. One is the. Uh, the uh, hammer tee is supposed to be their heavyweight, soft, um, soft style. I don't know what they want to call it, soft style tees, and their new um, 6400, which is the um, the ring spun cotton that they have. All right, first things first is the uh, 6400 cotton, 100% um, cotton, 4.5 ounce. It's nice. It's soft. It's really soft. Um, compared to a, let's say, a Gildan 2000. So let's compare it. This is actually my go-to, one of my go-to's uh, Gildan t-shirt is the 2000. Um, it's a six ounce cotton, cotton. So I think it's a pre-strung cotton, 100% cotton. I like the weight of it. It's not so heavy, like a seven ounce. But, um, I mean, compare it, it is, definitely the ring spun is much softer than the regular traditional um, tees that they have. Um, I don't know. It's it's lightweight. The the 6400. It is it is lightweight, but um, I don't know. Some people think it's too thin. 
the four the four point the four point five ounces. Some people don't like it as far as it being so thin, but they like the feel of it. So try to find a medium of it. But I still like the two thousand. Okay. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the uh, what do you call it? The hammer tees. The hammer tee. Here's the hammer tee. As you can see, Gildan Hammer Tee. So the Hammer Tee, so this Hammer Tee is uh, ring spun and it's six ounces. It's the same weight as the Gildan 2000, but the kicker is it has this ring spun feel, okay? And it's really nice actually. <laughs> to tell you the truth um, so this might be a um, this might be it for me you know I, I, I like it a little bit heavier you know as, as most people do I, I think and but it has this nice soft ring spun feel to it um, yeah let's see the cut the cut of the 2000 and the hammer tee is the same cut. This was oh, this was a medium, but as far as the neckline and the taper of the shoulders, it's exactly the same. Looks like, yeah. So I think I'm going to, as of right now, I'm going to be switching to the hammer tees just because I like the feel of it. Same ounce as the 2000. I mean, for me, I like the Triple A All Style brand and how they feel. But man, this Gilda one is really nice. It's almost the same, I would say, to the All Style. But anyway, hopefully that makes sense. Try it out, guys. Um, I would suggest if you like the more of the heavier tees with the soft feel, go with the Hammer tee. The Hammer tee is really nice. I would say. For me, if you like, if you're into the Bella Canvas feel of the t-shirts I will definitely give the um, the Gildan um, 6400 a try um, to me it has the same feel same lightweight and I think um, you'll be satisfied with this one but for me I like the hammer tee the hammer tee a uh, little bit of weight on it and it's actually really nice once again if you haven't done so if you want to be part of this giveaway I'm giving away this pink stuff right here and also the CCI, um, what is this, the WR14 uh, Emulsion. Yeah, so if you want to be part of this giveaway, uh, click on this link and it will take you to the giveaway video. Make sure you, you do all the items that um, I, I'm asking you guys to do to be part of this giveaway. And I'll be announcing the, the winner Thursday this week. Alright guys, that's about it. Peace out.